Hey my lovelies, welcome back to my channel. New week, new shopping haul. Uh, only one thing has changed. The main shopping came from Tesco this week, not from Aldi. However, I've still been in Aldi to pick up some bits and pieces. Actually, just to save time, I placed an order with Tesco. Uh, not for home delivery, but for click and collect because it's very convenient. I just go there, pick it up, five minutes, it's done. So the biggest part of my shopping is coming from there. And as I said, I got some bits and pieces from Tesco also. And I am cooking again next week based on the Slimming Eats book, which I've done also last week. And guys, to be honest, this book is amazing. If you've seen my video two weeks ago, that's when I purchased this book in Tesco. And that time around, I told you that I wasn't really fancy the first cookbook. However, this one, it's brilliant. Lovely, lovely recipes. Uh, even my husband says that mm, this is yummy. And this is big word from him, trust me. And the other thing, my weight is stagnating like two months ago. It's a little bit up and down, but it's not really moving. And eating based on this book, I lost five pounds last week five pounds I'm, I'm so happy about that so finally something is moving again so good 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 so uh i will show you in a minute what i purchased today and um, by the end of the video i'm going to show you my meal plan for the next week which i said it's coming again from this book but if you are new here hi my name is tunda i'm a full-time working mommy and i'm trying to do my shopping on budget as much as possible we are a family of three a husband me and my little daughter who is four years old lily so we don't even have a teenage boy around here <laughs> honestly the prices are insane i don't know we just had this conversation in the office yesterday that it's it's ridiculous already so my today's shops comes in 78 pounds in total so if you are new here and like shopping hauls um i would really love you to consider to subscribe to my channel and uh, i stop with the blah 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 and let's get into the video let's see what i bought today from tesco and all day so here we go left side is the tesco bit right side is the all the bit so let's start from the left side with tesco let's start with the meat things uh, actually i got a club card offer on the meats uh, at the moment they have the offer if you buy five items you pay only just for four items and the cheapest one is free so i used this offer i got two pack of chicken breasts uh, these are my usual chicken breasts 379 each of them one kilo they are same good as the fresh one but cheaper i got two pack of uh, cold water prawns they cost 350 each of them and i chosen this um, chicken portions this is two kilo pack it's cost only 282 would cost but i have this one for free because this was the cheapest from the five items so and this is a very very good amount of meat it's minimum three if not four four meals so two kilo for 282 or for free that's absolutely amazing um i've chosen these um veggie means not veggie so uh it's a chicken means but um also 30 percent of it uh, veg vegetables uh, i've tried this minced meat before i absolutely loving it uh, let alone very low fat it's around three percent and healthy and tasty and delicious and and cost two pounds so even price wise very good so i purchased two of them i have a uh, diced beef this one is 400 gram cost 379 shelf life is a little bit short however they warned me about it at tesco when i picked it up i said okay that's fine because actually it's straight away going to the freezer so no problem with that one and i got this pack of uh, pork lion steaks uh, this this is also on club card offer this is 600 gram i believe so yeah 600 gram and it's on club card offer at the moment for 320 so that's also not a bad price at all <laughs> my milk is alone this week imagine um last week we, lily 
had some stomach bug and since then she's refusing to drink her uh, coffee milkshake so i have a loads of milk never happened since she born she was born so i bought milk only for myself i think this one is 165 so for family i still got from this uh, uh green milk from the skin one and i still have long life from so i decided okay guys only mommy buying milk for herself this week um, usually you don't see me buying bread because usually we are not really eating bread however sometimes it's better to have some at home uh, i opted for this no added sugar wholemeal bread only 55 calorie per slice and i like this bread because i know that if i have this one i don't have this um, how to say it you know when you eat something and two hours later you are feeling like you're starving so if i have anything with this bread i don't have this problem it's definitely down to the no added sugar thing and if you're following slimming word i think two of them is your healthy extra b correct me if i'm wrong but i i believe you can have two slices of this one uh, it cost one pound in tesco but if you want the 800 grams they also got the 800 grams that one was 135 i think 135 but i know that that would go to waste so for us the small one is enough even by the weekend it will be still around so yeah uh, moving on sweet potatoes uh, one kilo of sweet potato cost uh, 99p i got two pack of um, tomatoes these baby palm tomatoes cost 69 penny uh pack pack bunch of spring onion that's 50 penny uh unfortunately my favorite chocolate fix is no longer on club card offer so i paid full price for this one it's two pounds now but hey ho i love this and sometimes i need this and it's helping me a lot philadelphia at the moment on club card offered 125 each i purchased two of them and this is the lightest lightest philadelphia so that co that's only three percent fat uh the activia no added sugar activia also on club card offered at the moment 150 each of them i picked a cherry one and a vanilla one a pack of pepper that's 115 and the protein yogurt are on club card offer also uh, originally one protein yogurt are la protein yogurt cost 125 however now if you are purchasing four of those then you get them for three pounds so that means one pot only 75 penny which is equal with the all the protein yogurt so i've decided i order this one now and let me see let me try these ones oh usual milk lightest mature cheese 269 uh cube of ginger puree 130 toilet wipe wet toilet wipe for lily and for everyone that's 59p or 65 59 i will pop it in the screen um, however if you want to buy wet wipes for yourself and you are going with the normal adult let's call adult wet wipes they the andrex one is i think already one pound but the other one's also like 65 or 75 penny have a look on the kids section because uh, these vibes, these store advice for the kids are cheaper. Also in Tesco, I think 59, not, not Tesco, sorry, in Aldi, 59 penny also, I think. And while for the adult ones, you got only 40 vibes for expensive money, money amount. Here you got 60 vibes. So for less money, more vibe. Definitely, if you are using wet vibes, go for the kiddie ones. You are going to save money then coffee for husband and i realized that i could have purchased this cheaper in uh, aldi so this one cost 225 and aldi it would have been only 185 anyway next time i know that one i needed some maple syrup for the recipes i wanted to wanted to i want to cook next week and i'm pleased to see that uh, tesco had the skinny syrup so i don't need to worry about the sugar and this kind of things that was two pounds uh one tomato puree because i got some in the cupboard i just wanted to pick one for extra that's 45 penny mouthwash for for everyone that's 45 penny i'm absolutely happy with the tesco oven brand mouthwash it does the same thing than the expensive brand so that's fine 
and i got some sauces which are also required for the recipes from the next week meal plan and i didn't have these kind of things at home so i have this sweet chili sauce that cost 175 dark soy sauce that's 65 penny fish sauce was uh, also 175 and red thai curry paste that's 180 and actually that was my online order uh, eggs they, they are never eggs anytime i want to order online they are never ever eggs available to order so forget about the eggs for now so what you've seen so far that cost me 60 pounds something 60 let me just hang on 60 27 but that one is including the picking packing for click and collect which is 175 and since i've been there i just popped into tesco because i know the eggs are cheaper there than in aldi so these eggs cost 179 15 of them yes i know they are not free range one but um, financial crisis yeah you understand so i picked two two of them because otherwise the eggs the free range eggs in all the cost 219 i believe yeah so this is a little bit cheaper it's almost a pound savings and now let's move on to all the part i haven't purchased that many things from there i needed on a proper all purpose clothes cleaning clothes uh, that cost one pound two pack of banana bananas i think 88 pen hang on let me see i have my receipt let me see how much was the banana yeah, 88 penny. Yeah. Uh, in Aldi, the prices are sneaking up like hidden and secretly. And anytime you go there, just a little penny here, a little penny there. And all the prices are seriously sneaking up. So I'm not that happy about that. I have these rosemary sausages. If you've seen my previous videos, you know that I love this one. I'm so happy to find this. However, again, usually it costs 115 today i found it for 125 so yeah company here and there sneaking prices up um i bought this pepper pig lentil puffs it's on the baby section in ali that cost one pound i needed a pack of toilet paper that's 339 this is three ply toilet paper i i like this one it's, it's a good value and a good quality one coconut milks because they are ne also again never ever available in tesco so this is the reduced one this cost 70 yep 79 pennies i bought two of them a pack of penna that was uh, 41 penny and for husband greek style uh honey yogurt uh this was one 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 hang on because it was above one pound let me find it yeah 105 so it has been cheaper before i believe uh i've seen in the middle aisle carpet fresh this one is the orchid one i really really love the smell of this one it is 199 and i believe bnm also has around the same price so i just picked it up because i'm still not planning to go to bnm anytime soon because i still got so many cleaning products that i'm forbidden to go to bnm and i got a panty liner for myself which is 47 penny so this is my weekly shop as i said it comes 78 pounds and 94 penny well could have been cheaper in it anyway this is what it is so let's move on and let me show you what the next big mail plan looks like so let's have a look on the mail plan sorry for that shadow i just i don't know where to go and how to because i need the light or maybe if i switch off this light uh, still not happen i put it back on so mail plan uh, today is monday i have a day off however i have plenty of things to do so i've chosen a quick recipe which is bang bang chicken pasta that one should look like that it promising me to be done in 25 minutes however i know that whatever i see i rather add 10 minutes and that's that's the correct timing but what i will need to prepare the dish then on tuesday i'm planning a jamaican chicken stew that's going to be on page 116 because i always put you know the page when i'm planning that where can i find the dish so i don't need to dig around on the book so 116 jamaican chicken stew it promising me to be done in 50 minutes plus marinating time 
this is how it's supposed to look like i'm a little bit skeptical about this recipe is because it says i will need honey for example so i really hope that the sweet taste i, I know jamaican jerk chicken jamaican things i've been in the country i love it but i know my husband as soon as it feels something is a little bit sweetish immediately he's rejecting the food so mm, i'm a little bit playing with the fire here but let's see so wednesday i'm already working however i'm going to work for the morning um i'm going to do a one pot thai excuse one pot thai brown rice that's on page 53 let's have a look quickly page 53 here we go one pot thai red brown and vegetable rice that should be done in 25 minutes thursday the plan is a hoisin pork that's on page 66 let me show you that one two 66 here we go yep that's how it looks like so this dish actually is getting ready in the oven and it seems so complicated but it promising me to be done in 30 minutes plus prep time and actually when i read the recipe is very very simple again some sweetish taste um, playing around in here if i remember well uh no not this one not in this dish one of one of them there somewhere was required some honey um let me see no no that, that this one this is the one tablespoon of honey yeah so again playing with the fire but let's give it a go friday i'm working my usual hours uh one pot smoky paprika sausage penna page 62 uh, if you watched my last week video, this was also on the menu. Uh, it's on the menu again because uh, Friday my husband been out in London. So actually my Friday meal plan, Friday dish was enough for us for Saturday. Also Saturday I didn't cook. So this one is coming over for the next week. Uh, Saturday the plan is a barbecue salmon rice bowl. That's on page 183. 183 yep here we go that's how it looks like i got salmon in the freezer we purchased that salmon before christmas so i think it's time to use it up and this recipe is look like it will do the job 30 minutes plus uh, 10 minutes preparation time and sunday i'm planning a slow cooker dish a slow cooker japanese beef curry 154 so that's how it looks like uh, my plan is to avoid takeaways for sundays because sundays i'm always coming home late start late coming home late and we are just tend to get uh, takeaways and i'm trying to oh hang on siri is talking to me oops sorry um so i'm trying to avoid the takeaways for sundays and i'm trying to plan a slow cooker meal for those days so yep so this was my meal plan this was my shopping haul and this was my success about weight loss with uh, slimming with with slimming eats cooking book so i hope you really enjoyed this video i hope you find some good deals what you can shop to today or this week in tesco and also i hope i could give you some idea what to cook especially if you are about to lose weight and you are calorie counting or following slimming world or just want to follow a low fat diet so if you like this please press the like button for me i would really 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 appreciate this and if you haven't subscribed yet i would love you to see in between my subscribers and next week uh not sure i'm going to do a whole video to be honest um i got some plans um plus also i'm going to travel very soon uh to hungary to visit my family so might for the next couple of weeks coming something else i will see okay i will see how i got time however i will see you next week and until then take care for yourself bye bye